This Christmas pageant ever, to me, is a beautiful illustration and funny story that brings to light what the angel said over 2,000 years ago when he showed up to those shepherds and he said, I bring you glad tidings of great joy for all men. And I think what Best Christmas Pageant ever is showing is that it really is for all men, and all men includes the herdmans. I think the difference at Kingdom Story Company is, yes, we want to make amazing art, and yes, we need to make money, because it's the only reason you get to make more movies is if you make money on your movies. But at the heart of it all, we all want to honor the Lord in our, in our work, of making the film, and in the end product. And when you all have that as a, as a similar goal, it changes the reasons why you make decisions, and it changes what drives you. So I think that's what makes it different working at Kingdom Story Company. The thing that surprised me the most about Dallas Jenkins is that he's hilarious. I've been a fan of The Chosen since it first came out. I've seen every season. Um, I watch a lot of his uh, social media posts just as a, a spectator um, and as a fan. And he's very direct in those posts, and he's very, um, has, he definitely has those points he wants to make, and he, he tells his, his, his story that he's trying to tell and tells about the facts of what's happening. I did not expect him to be quite so funny. He, he's just really, really quick-witted, um, and I think that that's gonna show in this movie. This movie has a lot of comedy in it, and I think it's gonna show in the way he cuts it together and in the work that he does with the actors. I, I think the comedy is gonna really show through. I think this movie is for anybody that loves Christmas, for one, um, but I think it's even more so for people that have a very nostalgic feeling about Christmas. Um, the fact that it's set in just sort of uh, uh, the past, um, the past that is anywhere from my childhood to my kid's childhood, is just sort of setting that world um, of what you remember growing up. I hope that audiences take away that Christmas is for everyone. Um, I think that, um, that there is a, a, an, a, a, like we assume that everybody knows about the story of Christmas. And I think that people take away that telling people about the birth of Jesus um, can be something that's fresh and new uh, for a lot of people because they're just not familiar with it. Watching what I'm watching on the monitor every day and the emotion of it and the comedy of it and the setting of it, um, I feel like it has all the, all the pieces are there for it to become a family classic Christmas film. So I really hope that Best Christmas Pageant Ever is playing 30 years from now and people just can't wait to sit down again and watch it on Christmas Eve.